Hi, I'm Jason Lachlan, and welcome to 123 Rockabilly Guitar. Rockabilly is a great style of music that's influenced generations of country, rock, and punk musicians. And though Rockabilly has a lot of different subgenres and uses a variety of techniques, it's not as hard as you might think to get started and play hundreds of Rockabilly tunes. One of the big misconceptions about Rockabilly guitar is that you have to learn a ton of Travis picking approaches, a lot of jazzy chords, a lot of flashy licks. But the truth is, if you just learn a handful of rhythm guitar approaches and a handful of lead guitar approaches, you're going to be able to play a ton of Rockabilly tunes. So here's how 123 Rockabilly guitar is going to work. I've divided it into three sections. Rhythm guitar, lead guitar, and repertoire. In the rhythm section of the course, I'm going to cover three common chord shapes in Rockabilly. The dominant 13th, the dominant 7, and the dominant 9. I'm also going to show you how to build 1-4-5 progressions, and we're going to learn three different ways to do that. A single string approach, a six string root approach, and a fifth string root approach. Then we're going to learn three rhythm guitar approaches that are commonly used in rockabilly. We're going to learn a boogie, we're going to learn a shuffle, and we're going to learn Travis Pickett. In the second section of the course, we're going to deal with lead guitar. So we're going to learn a handful of licks for what I think are three of the most common and important lead guitar approaches. We're going to learn about swing lines, we're going to learn blues lines, and we're going to learn the double stop approach. In the final section of the course, we're going to take everything that we learned, all of our rhythm and lead guitar approaches, and we're going to work through six instrumental studies together. And for each one of these instrumental studies, I'm going to show you the lead and the rhythm guitar part, and then we're going to have some fun playing them together. Everything covered in this course is going to be available in standard notation, in tab, in power tab, and in guitar pro. You also have all the backing tracks that you're going to hear throughout this course available to you. So you have a ton of different ways to interact with this course. All right, so kick on some slapback echo and let's get started.